Now, Chief Meteorologist Brian Davis and your Storm Team 2 forecast. Well, it won't be quite as cold tonight, but cold enough. It looks like temperatures overnight staying in the teens. 17 degrees at 7 o'clock. And some flurries, some snow showers around the area this evening. I think as we head toward later evening, especially uh, 11 o'clock and beyond, mostly dry weather overnight. 15 degrees at 9, 15 at 11. Uh, looks are dry in the early in the day tomorrow. 18 degrees at 8 o'clock with partly cloudy skies. But then the chance of snow showers returning, especially as we go into tomorrow afternoon, tomorrow evening. 25 at noon and at least tomorrow. We should be flirting with a freezing mark. We couldn't even get up to 20 today. Low temperatures tonight expected to dip down about 10 to 15 over the Miami Valley. Those winds will stay up. Eventually, some warmer air starts to move in from the south and west. And then tomorrow afternoon, expecting the readings in the lower end of the 30s. We did set a record low this morning. We were all the way down to 10 degrees. That broke the old record of 13 degrees in 1959. And we smashed the record low maximum temperature for today. 19 degrees is all we got up to this afternoon and the old record 27 back in 1972. Tonight in Beaver Creek, well, occasionally visibility is being reduced. A little bit of light snow falling from time to time. Maybe a skiff of snow out there, some drifting snow. That combination could create a couple of slick spots, so watch out for that as we go through this evening. But there is the band of snow now from uh, right around the 675-35 junction, extending back through our area here in Moraine, south side of Dayton, over to Farmersville. Some of that snow moving through. That band extending east and northeastward up to Yellow Springs, South Charleston, and Springfield seeing some of the snow. Not much northwest of us, as you can see. Uh, but back in Indiana, we're still getting some surface reports of light flurries around Indianapolis. So at least through the evening hours, we have a chance of some of that snow. Again, 19 are our high today, 10 our record low temperature. Just a trace of snow out at Dayton International Airport. Normals at 50 and 34. What would that feel like right now? And we're looking at what is more of a mid-January scene out there. 19 degrees with snow on the ground. West-southwest wind at 21 miles an hour. A wind chill currently at 3. And Springfield tonight, 17 degrees. A wind chill of six and a wind out of the south at 10 miles per hour. As we check out the temperatures tonight, notice the mid teens, the colder weather in the northern Miami Valley, upper teens to near 20 across the southern part of our region. And looking at uh, temperatures elsewhere, Indianapolis at 17, but 20 degrees at Cincinnati. Looking at the wind chill numbers, though, it feels like sub zero numbers in the northern Miami Valley and only about zero to five over the southern part of our region. Our future track forecast, even though we have some flurries around, now. Uh, those will tend to die out later this evening. We should be mostly dry overnight, but then some clouds move back in tomorrow and also the chance of some more snow uh, enters the picture as we go toward late morning and into the afternoon and that chance staying with us into the evening hours. A cold front, another push of cold air coming in from the northwest. That will reinforce the cold air, keep us below normal through the end of the work week. Partly cloudy, very cold tonight, still breezy, especially early tonight and some flurries this evening. We'll drop down to 14. Mostly cloudy, Windy, cold tomorrow, 32 the high, a few snow showers, at least a chance of those, maybe a light dusting of snow during the day as the cold weather continues, but at least it won't be frigid tomorrow. And your Storm Team 2 seven-day forecast, upper 20s on Thursday with partly sunny skies. Another cold day Friday, but after that, temperatures moderate, but the rain chances return for the weekend.